What's up, everybody? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I was just gonna like mouth it. <laughs> like, nobody like, can hear me. We're like, what? Like, uh, I'm trying to run this YouTube video because I had something from my, um, you know, like sometimes somebody will say something and it's like, um, like it just triggers something like right? A, like an old memory or something mm -hmm. like that. And you're yeah. like, Oh my God, that, I did do that. Or this did happen. And then you're like, Oh my God, this is happening. So, anyway. so which, uh, YouTube video is it? It's this thing. All right. So when I very first got, do you remember like the first check you wrote? The first check? Yeah. Like when you first got your first check in the account, how old were you first off? Were you like. Uh, you wasn't in high school. I was were you? sixteen. You really? Fifteen or sixteen? Yeah. Man, I didn't get mine until I was like at least eighteen or nineteen. Oh, really? I was graduating. I knew that. Mm -hmm. So, do you remember what your first one was? Probably to something my parents told me to write it to. <laughs> hey, write a check to this and give them money. And I'm trying to think of maybe one that I had to do. And I write them all the time now. Yeah. And I'm trying to think of my very very first one. I can't. You can't. Uh. -uh. Mine was, there was this thing, and if you probably remember this, you're going to die when I tell you this story. So, um, you, they had these infomercials on TV, uh -huh. and one was Darren's Dance Grooves. What? Do you remember that? Uh-uh. you never seen that? And so, uh, what we're going to do is, um, right now, we're probably going to put the video of it up first. Do you wonder where Britney Spears or NSYNC got their moves? Here's your chance to get the inside look at how it's done. With Darren's Dance Grooves, the new video that breaks down the moves and shows you how to do them step by step. We step back on our right leg and then move forward. It is definitely the best choreographer of all time. His unique street style dance steps have been featured in music videos, award shows, and concerts seen around the world. Dancing's all about having fun. Now you can get down with my new video. Ain't no lie. Now these fresh moves are available for you to learn on Darren's Dance Grooves. Plus, Darren will show you his brand new pop and lock routine. I break it down so you can learn the dances at your own speed. When you're watching this choreography, you just want to get up and do it with them. Darren's Dance Grooves is not sold in any store. This is going to be the hottest video you've ever seen. To order, call the number on your screen or log on to musicspace.com. Must be 18 or older to call or log on. But anyway, the whole point of it is that Darren was this guy that you, because I was obsessed with boy bands uh -huh. and Britney Spears and all that, because this is that the pinnacle of all that. You oh, know yeah, I mean? this is when it started. Yeah, and uh, man, so you were probably, because if I was 18 or 19, yeah, you were young. I mean, you were in... I was yeah. fourth, fifth grade, yeah, probably. Yeah, yeah. So, and so, um, so this guy, he like did music videos for them, and so he you would buy his video, and he would show you... <laughs> can't even say it. It's like he would show you how to do the dance. And yeah. Stuff. So it was Darren's dance grooves. And he's just like, he's like, you guys got this. He's like, we're going to do the, this Britney Spears. Oops, baby, one more time. And you do it. And he's like, he's like, let's do it. And one, and two, and three. And you're just like doing it. So so we, everybody would come over like after church or something like that. And we'd go to my house and do Darren's dance grooves. But I remember like. Man, I was, how many of y'all would do it? Like a, a few of us. So I don't know. But like you had just like groups and y'all yeah. do it every like yeah, no, we wouldn't perform it or nothing like that. But it was just the point of Darren's dance cruise because I don't know why I was just one of those people. I'm one of those people that like if there's a good prize in a cereal, I'll get it. Even oh. it, even if it's like wheat thins or some of like that, or not wheat thins, that's crackers. But like shredded wheat, you know, yep. I hate that stuff. Um, if it's got a good, you know, Superman prize, I'm like, I'm buying it. I'm yeah. buying twelve boxes. Do you ever eat the cereal? Sometimes. Sometimes you're like, nah, I don't eat cereal too much, but. Um, so anyway, so my first check, what it was, was, um, it was one of those checks you could do by phone. So I called in the number. I mean, it was like on my lunch break. It was back, uh, we just talked about how I worked at the scooter store. Oh yeah. Talked about it in, my, in the previous podcast, which listen up. It was a good one. Yeah. And so we, um, so they were like, oh, we can do a check, a check over the phone. And I was like, really? And I was blown away how they could take a check over the phone. Yeah. And it just like blew my mind. So I'm sitting there like, and I'm giving them the numbers, the routing number at the bottom, that kind of thing, you know, from take it. Uh, of course, is I thinking back on it You basically just gave him your bank information. I probably just could have. Yeah, yeah. And so, anyway, so it was like nineteen ninety nine plus tax. It was like around like twenty one, twenty two dollars, and it came in like three or four weeks later. No CODs. Remember how they would always say new, no CODs? Yeah. And to me, forever, you know what that is? Cash on delivery. So in other words, there's there used to be places because um, I used to work at this music store, and some places um, like a pizza. Yeah. Yeah, like a pizza that would be delivered, and you so, so they have an invoice, so you would give the money to the UPS person. Yeah, or they so they actually used to do CODs. 
It's crazy to think. Man, that, that would suck for the UPS driver. Like, yeah. crap, now I got to keep all those yeah. money. I bet a lot of people were just stealing it. Yeah. A lot of times they would probably just checks, though, I would think. I doubt they would take cash. You know what I mean? Right. But, um, so anyway, so, um, so Darren's dance groove came in the mail, and, uh, you guys can see what a clip of what Darren Sands Groove looked like, and it's uh, it's, it's pretty cheesy now. But I want to pull it up. It's funny. It's funny. I mean, it's and it's Darren's Dance Groove. Yeah. How do you spell it? Just Darren, like a normal Darren. D a r r i n. Oh, I n. Okay. Yeah. He spells it like a dancer. Darren. <laughs> Darren Dance Grooves, as seen on TV. So as soon as you type in um, Darren's Dance Grooves will come up. Oh. Okay, yeah. Oh, okay. So like the old <laughs> school like P90X and but with dancing. So, yeah. But it wasn't like marketed like an exercise thing. You know what I mean? But like Oh, you, so you're watching them do it. Okay. But there's actually an infomercial that the one we're, the video we're going to post will be actually the actual infomercial on TV. Oh, as seen on TV. Yeah. yeah. Well, I think it was just kind of playing through my headphones. Yeah, it was. But we're going to post the real video. Matt is super, like, he's our tech guru. He's amazing at that Ugh. kind of stuff. It's a pain in the butt because I'll come to him and I have these ideas like, hey, Matt, let's do this for the aftercast. He's like, sure, sure. Like, two days later when he's editing, he's like, mother. I mean, I know I know you got to be mad at me. I know it. Like, because I'll have all of these ideas where I want to do videos or, hey, Matt, can you post a picture here? And I'm like, I'll send a picture for our aftercast. And so the ideas are here, but yet this is the man that gets it done. So Well, it's not, I don't know. I like But doing you're good it, at it, though. But it's. It gave, it gave me a reason to learn how to do it. Yeah. Because without doing something like this, you're like, well, I would never want to learn yeah. that. Now you're like, you give me something harder to do, and I'm like, crap, yeah. okay, let's figure out how this. to do it. Because I don't, and I don't like, want to And 99% else to do it. of the time, I'll get a text that says, oh, it didn't turn out good or it's horrible. And then he sends me a video and it looks amazing. I'm like, uh, what? I was like, his, like, his standards for himself, which is a good thing to have. I mean, it's not the bad, but his standards for himself, I think, is like way up here. And me, I'm like, it's amazing. And he's like, no, it's horrible. I'm like, dude, you did a good job, you know. So that could be it, or I it's really it bad. And Jeremy's just like, no. I just don't want to edit, so no. I'm just gonna tell him this, that it's, it's good. The, I don't want this beautiful face to be messed up on YouTube. Yeah, you're right. It's true. So I mean, it's yeah. good. And so, but anyway, so this Darren Dance Cruise, you guys, we're gonna. I hope you guys like this video, but um, the Darren Dance Cruise video, not this video, but Lord like this one too, I guess. Yeah. But the Darren Dance Cruise is just so funny. But um, it'd be funny, like in the comments, you know, if, if if there's anything on TV you guys have ever uh, bought. Have you ever bought anything on TV? Nope. Oh, yes, I have. I bought the Now. That's what I call music. Off the TV. Off though? the TV. Yes. Those infomercials are like legit. Yep. They suck you in. You know what I mean? I've watched this one video where it's like um, white people doing things that, and it's like you know how like they'll like try to open up the Tupperware thing and they like go somewhere and they're like, oh, oh yeah. Wah, wah, wah. But you know what's crazy you know? is those actually work. Oh, people buy them. Yeah. But now luckily, no, I they, meant like not the product, yeah. but the the, the commercials. The commercials yeah. yeah. Nowadays they have where you can um, buy it at Walmart. You know they have a section, the SCN TV section, mm -hmm. so they you don't really have to buy them too much in the stores. The company, well, remember Snuggies? Oh, the same thing. Yeah, Snuggies. Remember that? I remember Snuggies were like a big popular thing. And um, oh, Snuggies got huge, dude. My when I worked for the scooter store because we always did promotional stuff. We'd send them to like doctors' offices or like um, nursing homes, that kind of thing. Uh -huh. And one of the things we did one year for Christmas was we they made Snuggies with their logo on them. And oh, so, wow. and we had tons of them left over. I still use it when I go to the beach. That's what I use for a beach blanket. <laughs> oh, the snuggie? snuggie. That's snuggie, yeah. Man, that's funny. But fun. there's some of them like um, the ones that got me were like um, the Snack Master. Remember the Snack Master? It was like that 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 grill thing. Oh so, yeah. So you make make the best like like pizza grilled cheese or something. Yeah, and the perfect egg. Yes. And it was just little silicone thing. But now, dude, I saw one. I guess it's been. Um, well, I guess probably about a year now. Yeah. But it feels like it was sooner. And it's the hula hoop thing, and you run it across your dog, and your dog steps through it, and it washes your dog. Oh, so it's got water like coming through it. Mm -hmm. oh, so if cool. you can imagine like a hula hoop, yeah, which is it's probably ah, it's three smart, three fourths of a hula hoop, and then yeah. you hold it here, and then you just run it through your dog, and you're like, holy <clears> cow! <throat> and it's people run it through their horses. Yeah. And you go. Oh, See, nowadays okay. we have they have Shark Tank. You know, so people are on yeah. there advertising their stuff like. I think the Squatty Potty, I've, um, I think somebody, I did use one one time and it really does. Like, I know it sounds cheesy, but it, it's legit. Have you ever used one before? Uh uh. It makes a difference. Does it? Does it? It does. It, it's weird to say, but it does. Yeah. And I tell you how you get, how people out there can make some money. And I'll just tell y'all real quick. Uh oh. Find a product that is super popular that's not technically patented. Or oh. change it up a little bit, maybe have a little stare over here. Yeah. But the Squatty Potty only had in one color. 
Well, you had no. this other person that came out and had them in black, red. All they did was just change yeah. and make all. Boom! Now they're a millionaire. And the, they took that idea and changed the color. And dude, and John, dude, man, you can make that stuff yeah. so cheap. So I had to come out with one that's pink, and mm. I called it the pink pooper. The pink pooper. That's what you had come no, out. No, I no, I say that would be, you know. Oh, I see what you're saying. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, I have like some little entrepreneurial ideas in my head. And I'm always afraid to say it because I like I feel like as soon as I put it out there, it's gonna like someone's gonna have it. Oh know? man, it's I've talked to so many people that have a million of them. Yeah. And there's a lot of them that I want to steal, but then sometimes I'm like, mm, don't want to go through all the work doing all this. Yeah. But there was a good one. Well, now nah, I'm not gonna say it. I think like I'm gonna uh, save it. One Maybe good product on the market one day. We talked about like food poisoning and stuff like that. Like a pocket uh, digital thermometer. That way you can just carry it with you to a restaurant, pop it in there, like, just to test your food real quick. Oh, in your food? <laughs> yeah. Dude, for yeah. Some, you know what I thought? Like a butt thermometer? Yep. Or, but I was thinking, like, why would you need to check your temperature? Yeah. Like, am I sick? Be a yeah. And then you go, okay, well, it's digital. It's no, always, your yeah, it's always your in your butt. And you go, I wonder what Ew. my temperature Ew. is. Gross. It's just no. go to the thing. So I get it now. Yeah. You know what I mean? How picky would you be, like, if you're on, a, like, you're out on dinner and everything, and you're like, mm-hmm. put the thermometer in your food. <laughs> nope, send this back. Yep. Oh, that would so be funny. crazy. I'm, I'm that person that when I go to a restaurant, um, my friends get so mad because they're like, give me this. They fold their mini up to them, and I'm like, can I have this? But can you take off this? But can you add this? And then can you, like, I'm mm-hmm. that guy that people hate. But I don't know. I'm just. I'm just know. real meats and potatoes type guy. I know. Just like, real like, Those simple. friends are like those little basic bitches. They're like, I just want um, chicken fingers and honey mustard. Yeah, I'm not. I'm, like, I'm, dude, fries, I'm not big on chicken fingers. Um, yeah. You know. Let me tell you what I miss. What? Did you ever go to the Mexican restaurant and would get the chicken fingers with the cheese dip? Yes. I miss that. I used to be. Because you got to realize. Fact, that's where I'm going. After me, I'm gonna like still when got I was especially like, in my church days, that kind of thing, I was super picky. I ate chicken fingers everywhere I went. Mexican restaurant. I didn't eat sushi. You see, now I eat a lot more different stuff. So yeah, but yeah, I was chicken finger guy like always. So yeah, and I and I did that one day. Got it with the chili, cheese dip, and you're like, hallelujah. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm fixing to call the Mexican place <laughs> right now. So and then once you get the Mexican place, you come home and you do Darren's dance groups. Now that it's on YouTube. Oh yeah, now I don't have to. Now you don't have to pay the pay 1995. With the but it's funny, like you know, like if you call now, you get three Darren's dance grooves, one to give to a friend and one to keep back up. Yeah, if you mm-hmm. call in the next thirty minutes only. So if I call in forty five minutes, you're not going to give it to no. me. No, nope. no, they mm-hmm. are full of it. That is not. Oh, you guys check out our podcast watching. that we did before this on iTunes, SoundCloud, Stitcher. Yep. And Google, Google Play. Play. Yeah, check that out. And Spotify next week, probably. Yeah, probably was, yes. So, guys, thanks for watching. Thank y'all. Darren's Dance Grooves. That's it. Bye, 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 bye. I can't get the, uh, oh, there it goes right there. <laughs> I like my instinct the better. What bye, is it? Bye. Yeah, we should have just let yours. That was yeah. good.